Hello, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I am Disco Kitty, the Crappy Crafter. But today, I'm going to be the Crappy Nail Artist because we are going to play with... Mariah Elizabeth's Nail Polish. I'm really excited about this. I have a nail art channel. I've been running it for years. You'll be able to see this video over there as well. I'll link it below. It'll be different because this is not how I run that channel, but I'm really excited. Let's get into it. Okay, for those of you who don't follow my nail art channel, and I know out of all of you, there is only one. Hey, how you doing? Anyways, for those of you who don't follow my nail art channel, here is a really quick tour of all of my nail polish. Just showing this to show that I am no slouch when it comes to owning nail polish. I have more bottles than I can count in a lot of different varieties. Even got some of the lovely Hollow Taco stuff. Not all of them, just the first few boxes. So much nail polish. So I, I like to think that I know what I'm talking about? I probably don't, and that's okay. It's still fun to play with anyway. And you are not imagining anything. These are bins from an Ace Hardware. I got them when they switched over to new bins. They were selling the old bins and I, I grabbed a few. It helps that I work there, of course, so I got them for free. But nail polish bottles fit just perfectly in them. And I use so much of these two, I have to get them in four ounce bottles. Okay, let's get this open. I love the box. The box is so pretty. Little hollow details. And the packaging is so pretty. Top coat. Cotton candy. Crisp cantaloupe. Serene Sky, Key Lime Cream, Pale Plum, Soft Sunshine, and yes, later I will put these in the wrong way. Let's start with a little cotton candy. This one was a little sheer, but it's still self-leveling and it is a lovely color. I'm absolutely in love with it. Oh, who am I kidding? I'm in love with all of these colors. Crisp Cantaloupe is the most sheer of the bunch. You're going to need two coats if you want that to be opaque, but it is absolutely lovely. A little soft sunshine to brighten your day. This is where we start to get into the more thicker ones and it goes on wonderfully. It self levels, it's bright. Key Lime Cream is also very thick and opaque and self-leveling very lovely cream a little serene sky also a thick one it is lovely goes on smooth pale plum this one goes on really well you can actually watch it self-level right here can you see that there it goes Beautiful. I know these aren't stamping polishes. Let's try anyway. Starting out again with the cotton candy. You gotta scrape it and you gotta pick it up fast and then you gotta lay it down on your nail real fast. Now these are very stringy, which isn't really something I've come across a lot of in stamping polishes, but it doesn't really surprise me. Next is the Soft Sunshine. Yes, I did skip the cantaloupe. We'll come back to it. I just, I didn't put them down on the table in order and I'm a moron. But look at that. Look at how it pops on the black. It's beautiful. Now for the Key Lime Cream. You can't really see the green so well. It looks more yellow in the black, but that's okay. It's not a stamping polish. Now we go back to the cantaloupe, and this works pretty well as well. I have to say, I was really impressed with how well these non-stamping polishes stamped. They're good. 
the uh, serene sky is very lovely. And last but not least is the pale plum, my personal favorite, but you know, it's purple, so I love it. I love purple. Lovely. Now let's try out this top coat. It goes on very smoothly. It's very thin. It's very glossy, very, very shiny. It is a very pretty top coat. I love it. I probably won't use it much because I do have my preferred one, but this works very well. It doesn't even smear the stamped polish, which a lot of top coats will. Just look at how glossy that is. It is so shiny. Obviously, I haven't tested durability, so I can't tell you how long it'll last, but I'd like to think that it'll last at least a week, a good solid week. When I opened the box the first time to film it, I didn't even notice that there was text on the inside. I am such a moron. Here you go. You can pause it if you want to read it. And then here are all the polishes back in the box in the wrong order with their little swatch nails right next to them. Oh, such a pretty box. Such pretty polishes. Great job. I think these worked pretty well. Here's the whole collection. I think I would value these at an upper mid-level tier nail polish. They're very nice. They come with their own top coat, which is wonderful. It's too bad they don't have a base coat, but you can't have everything. So use your own base coat, and then the polishes, and then the top coat that's provided. A couple of the colors are a little bit more sheer than the others, so you might have to do two coats with those. Remember to let them dry between layers. And speaking of drying, these dried pretty well. They're not the fastest, that's for sure, but they certainly aren't the slowest. I found I was able to still put fingerprints in the top coat 10 minutes after application, so just be careful and you'll be fine. I think these worked really wonderful, and I think Mariah did a great job choosing these colors. They are fantastic. I love them. I always love having a full set of rainbow polishes. I don't have a set of pastel polishes, so this will go great with my collection. This box will go sit with my hollow top coats. And remember, never store your polishes flat. If you don't screw the lid on tight enough, the polish can get into the, 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 the cap, it can leak a little, it'll get gummy and gross. Always store your polishes standing up. And with that said, I think these are great. We'll see you next week. Stay safe. Here they all are. I think they're basically equivalent to net to any to to the middle of the oh. Oh, did you scare yourself? Oh. Come here, I will give you cuddles. Ooh, oh, oh yeah. Oh, what perfect timing. Mm -hmm. Mm. You're such a good snuggle. Yes. Okay, bye.